Hello boys and girls, this is a status report or update on the repair of the Panasonic RX 5250. I want to show you my history with this radio. So here I have pictures from the year 2010. All right. So in this folder, let me start open with that. And you can see the pictures are taken with the date code of 2010. All right. This is the one I had way back when. All right. So there is the front, the back. Uh, an old screwdriver I used to use. I no longer still have it, but it needs new batteries. I don't know what I'm pointing at, but okay. And then there's the inside of it. All right. And measuring the speakers, they're pretty dirty. Those are. Right, again, that's so. This is when I lived in Houston. I don't live in Houston anymore. But what are we looking at here? Who knows? Okay, I took the tweeters off. That's what the tweeter looks like. It's just a whatever. Another picture. And then here's the tape deck. Of course, I didn't know what I was looking at too much back then. And then here is the. Um, Oh, this is where the speaker plugs in, right there. Okay. <coughs> and, um, oh yeah, let's see here. No, we don't have that. Okay. And then, um, well, all right. Well, anyway, there's that. And then that picture, and another picture of the front. Mine's a bit scratched up. There's a pretty good scratch on mine right there, but who cares? All right, what else? Another picture, and it's all back together, I think. Yeah, okay, so done with that. Now let's go to the next folder, which is this one here from 2014. All right, so open with that. So here's some more pictures of uh, the one that uh, Ernie, I think his name was, sent me for repair. <coughs> so, here's that side, this side, that side there. And again, we're looking at the recording bar switch, which I'm going to show you in a moment. That's why I made this video. Okay. And here is, let's see here. Well, this is upside down, this picture, but... Anyway, this is the picture of the circuit board in the back. Because what I had to do with his was reflow. These are, you know, reflowed the uh, RCA inputs to make them work. Better picture. And then this again is a recording bar lever. All right, it goes up. That's the recording bar switch. It's about oh four inches long or so. All right, and this is pushed on by that tab right there, okay, which is, anyway. And, okay, great. Now here is the other end of this recording bar lever thing. And it comes down almost on top of the battery compartment. And it swings, as you can see, it goes from one side to the other and it's supposed to move. When the, re, uh, when the cassette deck is, let's see here, in operation. So, what am I pointing to here? Uh, I don't know. Anyway, these are you know, pictures from eight years ago. So, and uh, I had his and I had mine. So, here's two models. There's mine and his. As you can see, his is anyway. And so that that just measuring other speakers to see if they would fit and I think that's it for those. So now I'm going to get to today's pictures. What the heck? So here I just open with so here we are 2022 okay 2022 great so there's the front of this one top picture that end the, the other end that's what it takes right there 13.2 in, okay. That's the back. And 
then uh, there's the uh, yes, it's a 5250. Okay. And there's the battery compartment. It does have a screw in there. All right. And then there's a picture of the bottom. No one ever takes a picture of the bottom, but I do. And then here's these controls. It's kind of hard to take a picture with this because it's so shiny and re reflective. So I took a picture like this. <coughs> and then uh, another picture over here so you can see it better. Okay. Then there's a picture of the, you know, the tape deck itself, right? And then here's where all the screws go. These are the screws I took out. So there's one up there, one up there, one, two, one, two, and then missing one of this hole here. Well, it came out in the video, but it's not the same as these screws. It has a shank that goes down here and then the thread starts. So it's a different one, it's a different length. All right. Um, and as I open this one up, there are screws missing. Now this is supposed to come off, but it's not supposed to be flying around already, but anyway. Okay, so there's that. Now this is missing. There's a screw that goes in that hole there that holds this panel on. All right, so I just wanted to point that out that that is missing. And there's one missing over here. Okay, that's how that works. And then here's just a picture of the inside of it. And boy, I'm not done. And here, here's a picture of both pieces connected. All right. And then that's where the speaker wire goes. As I mentioned in another picture previously. Okay. Then that's the inside of the front, okay. And it's you know that kind of speaker right there, would be. And then that's the tweeter. Sorry, it's fuzzy. Oh well. Okay. And then here's what I'm trying to point to. This is the recording bar level. That's my finger. <laughs> and it's you know 2022 that I'm doing this with. And again. Here is a different picture, and that's the last picture I took. Because now, there we go back to the front. So now, what I want to show you is this. Okay. Uh, let's see, how do we do this all in one shot? I see here. I need this to come here. Oops, that was out. <laughs> Lock that up again. Rotate this around. Okay, how can we do this so you can see this working? I need to be able to see as well. Here, let's put it this way. How about? It? Yeah, there we go. Great. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, this is okay. Now let's plug it in. Okay. So let's get a plug and um. Zero eight. Okay. That's good. So let's plug it in. Power cord. Okay. So plug it in. Heard that, right? I guess we can do it like this. If I bring the camera down, wait. Bring the camera down. Okay. All the way down. Okay. And then, yeah, that's, that's the way I would do it. I gotta get this right in front of me. Um, well, let's see if I rotate this. If I get a, a headlight, where's my headlight? Here's my headlight. Okay. Alright, so. Here we go. Headlight. All right. So this is here. This thing's going to auto adjust, right? What I'm trying to show you here is that, okay. This is. You can see the. Yeah, that's on. That's the radio. There's no speakers. That I do have headphones attached, but there's nothing on there. And of course, here is the level meter thing okay so it's receiving a sa station and, and working but what I want to show you is this right here this is the I can get my finger to it again wait all right how did I do it before okay down here no nope. wait um I guess I have to do it this way wait Well, okay. Um, well, 
this here. Okay, this is how the just can't do this. It's really hard to make this thing someone look over my shoulder and okay. Um, well, okay. Um, this is gosh darn. Here. Let's put the flashlight on here, see if the camera can catch it. All you can see is my hand, right? Well, that's not good. Oh, what fun. Let's see here. Let's move the camera down. Let's see. Drop the legs. Okay, drop the legs. Okay, yeah. No, yes, fine. There we go. Drop the legs. Okay, drop the legs, drop the legs. Okay, now. Open it back up. Okay. And then. Back to the flashlight. All right. I know I could just say this, but I want to illustrate this too. See, where are we looking? Well, okay. Let's see if I can get the camera over from my point of view. How about? Will that work? I need to see the viewfinder. Oh, that's such fun. Okay, so here is, yeah, that'll work. All right, uh, okay, let's move it from your other hand. Wait, okay, rotate this back around. Right, there we go. So now, this here. Well, that's on the pivot. How do I make this all work before? Um, here, maybe if I get my hand, oops, wait, come back here. All right, this is such fun, okay. Well, okay, bottom line here is that thing is supposed to move, all right? Wait, let me see if I can, oh, man, just, mm. all right, okay, put this thing on your head now. This thing, right? Okay, put it on your head. Okay, so there we go. Okay, that's how I did it before. You see that there? This is supposed, let me zoom in, right? Zoom in the other way. Oh, I keep it in focus though. Okay, so this is supposed to move like that, all right? That's how it's supposed to move, right? Remember, this thing is plugged in, so now, if we get this thing out of the way, right, and if we, I'm not going to put a tape in here, but I'm going to white out so you can hopefully remember that part there, and move the camera back, right, okay, remember it's, okay, so it's, it's that bar right there, okay, now if I hit, this is record, wait, This is play. See it come up and play, right? And then this is uh, stop. Wait, that's stop. This is pause. That's okay. Um, anyway, that's eject. Okay, that's stop. All right, so that's play. That's on pause. All right, so. Okay, this is okay. So this is play. Alright, this is stop. This is record. Alright, now record. Wait. Record. Oh, okay. Let me do it like this. Uh, where is the front of this radio? Okay. Just so we know, record is the second button over. Okay. So, to make this work, if you want to record something, you can't do it until you can't do it until you push on this button here, okay? And let's see here, good grief. The only way to release that button is to push this up with your finger. And then you can push on that. And it does work. Well, that's interesting. 
Okay, well, it does work. All right, well, anyway, so it does work, but there's still no sound coming out of this model. So I wanted to show you that before I took this thing any further apart. All right, so good day, bye-bye, thanks for watching, and I'm having way too much fun here. Bye-bye. Still no sound of this model. But I do have a definite electronic smell that is working. And like I said here, it's, it's receiving a station, but there's no sound via my headphones, which are plugged into the headphone jack here. And I can't get any sound whatsoever. I, can't, I can get a blip, but that's it. I can't hit any sound whatsoever. So that's all I'm letting you know. Thanks. Good day. Bye-bye.